protests erupt across Mexico after gasoline prices jumped more than 30 cents overnight as the new year began. Hundreds of people filled border crossings hoping to find cheaper gas. Now the Deconcini port in Nogales is closed to traffic heading into Mexico because of the protests. Nine News Sides Max Darrow joins us across the border in Nogales, Sonora with more. Max. We are just feet away from the Deconcini point of entry here in Mexico, where you can see a giant group of people is, are protesting right now. You can hear them right there. They are protesting these new gas prices. Just listen for a moment. Signs, chants, you can see it all. We are on the train tracks just feet away from the United States. They're saying they're on these train tracks to protest against the government and make them lose money because they feel these new prices are not fair and they are losing money. One person I spoke with told me it takes him 10 days of work now to get just one tank of gas. These prices are up nearly 20% at some stations. Now, these people have been out here for a couple of days. They tell me they plan to continue to be out here peacefully protesting until the law changes and until those prices go down. This is just one of many protests across Mexico. They say this is not meant to be a problem for the American government. They are protesting their government. You can see this sign just right over here. They're taking photos. They are trying to make a point here. They tell me on Saturday there will be an even larger protest at another port of entry. And we will keep you updated with these prices and what happens here with this protest with KGON 9 on your side. For now, we're reporting live in Nogales, Sonora. Max Darrow, KGON 9 on your side.